A call for transparency and justice. Loved ones of the May 31st Virginia Beach mass shooting held a press conference this morning. They claimed the city ignored their trauma and lacked care and concern for the families of the 12 people who lost their lives. Tonight on your side's John Dowding is live outside the Virginia Beach Municipal Center with the latest. John, there were some powerful statements read in that conference. Yeah, Asia Bianca, the main one of those saying the time is now. This was a message echoed by a number of those family members and by Justin Fairfax, who was representing a number of those of the family members here. And part of this whole discussion today, this whole press conference was for these families to call out the city of Virginia Beach for in their opinions, where they're saying that enough is enough. And they've been wanting answers for over the last three and a half years. Now, families who spoke out today say they feel the city continues to not be transparent, disrespect them and not provide proper resources. Fairfax has who, as I said before, is representing some of these families says last last week's discovery of that personal laptop, that alleged personal laptop that allegedly belonged to the shooter did not motivate today's press conference, but he says that discovery is proof that there are still questions swirling around the investigation into exactly what happened here three and a half years ago. And part of their effort to get answers will also include taking any legal avenues that they are able to. But to get to the point, family members say enough is enough. They want answers, they want transparency, and they need resources. Now, coming up tonight on Waving News 10, starting at 4, I'll have more details from these family members, and you'll hear from some of them as well. Live in Virginia Beach, I'm John Dowding. 10 on your side.